Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to do a special request for my friend Brian. This is Sinead O'Connor's Troy. Um, I have not heard this song in a really, really long time and probably only once, so I'm pretty new to this. So I'm going to get started. If you have any comments, questions, or statements of intent, please leave them in the comments section below. And uh, remember that that is your space to have a conversation and to tell me things that I've missed and to fill in the details that I might not necessarily know about this particular performance. And with that, let us begin. I remember it In Dublin in a rainstorm We're Sitting in the long grass in summer Keeping warm Tell me, when did the light die? You will rise. You'll return the phoenix from the flame. You will learn. You will rise. I'm going to stop here for a second. The the thing about Sinead O'Connor that is really has always caught my attention is her ability to talk to you through song. She's very, very conversational, and she's very introspective at the same time. So a lot of the songs that I've heard from her are very expressive, but they're very internalized. They're, they're, they talk about her internalized strives or or stuff like this. And so... Here she is using a very conversational tone to set the pace. And she's also using, she has a really great tone with her, when she flips up into her head voice and she uses those breaks in her voices effectively to bring about emotional changes in the song. And so that coupled with the, the instrumentation underneath is, is something that draws out a lot of the emotion for the listener. And it draws us into the conversation that she's having with herself or in other songs with other people. So I'm going to take it back a couple of seconds because it's building up to something. And we will continue. Like right there. In that section there, she's using pitch in a very interesting way to 
reignite and to to show us the torment that's going on inside her. It's not necessarily perfectly on pitch. It's not off off, but it's just enough of a whale to get us to really start feeling the same emotions that she's feeling. So we're going to go back and listen to that and we will move forward. And when I say that she's playing with pitch, she's using it rhetorically. She's using it with purpose to get across a message. So even though on American Idol, they talk about pitchiness in a bad way, the way she's using it here is to reinforce the character of the song. So I'm going to leave it right here. Um, what I really like about Sinead O'Connor in in all of the songs that she does is is again it's it's the emotional commitment. I didn't stop too much during a lot of the emotional side of the song, like the 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 louder side of the song, um, because there's. That's that's one of the things that she's really good at is she's really good at bringing you in with really soft stuff. And then she's really good at 
letting you have it, so to speak. And that's 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 that emotional commitment that she's always had, and that's what sustains any great artist's career is their ability to bring people in emotionally to their songs or to tap into an emotion that their audience wants to to feel. Whether it's escape or whether it's complete emotional breakdown, that's that's what an artist is supposed to do. And and Sinead O'Connor understands her instrument and what it can do in a way that brings out emotion. And then also you add in a video where, and again, I believe this was very early in her career, so this should be the late 80s. Yeah, it should be the late 80s, probably early 90s. I don't know exactly. But the cinematography, the art direction in this this video is very, very symbolic of that that emotional tor- turmoil that she's going through. So there's a lot of flames, there's a lot of darkness, there's a lot of m- makeup used strategically to help reinforce the message. And that's the stuff that I, I've taken away from this. And it, it goes really well with what Sinead is known for. And so um, I'm going to leave it to you guys. You can talk about this in the comments section below. If I've missed stuff, let me know if there's stuff that you want uh, to add to the conversation. Because again, this is my first real view of this now that i've looked at it i don't remember it uh if i did see it it must have been a decade or more ago so um i don't remember it uh so if you want to fill in some details below that i don't necessarily know um please do so that is your space down below if you didn't like it just move on um but with that i'm gonna let you guys enjoy your day enjoy your holiday it should still be the holiday season when i release this so i'm gonna let you go and enjoy that and as always be safe Thank you.